Pisces, Pisces. <sighs> oh, spirit. What do we have for Pisces, December 2020, my collective? Pisces, December 2020, my collective, please. What do you have for Pisces? Pisces, Pisces. Oh, something's not quite coming together. Uh-huh. A little sticky situation. Okay, I got something might explode. Some, some, something might explode, whatever the hell that means. Something ain't coming together, so shit might explode. I don't think like an explosion explosion. I think just like some shit may get stirred up. What do you have for Pisces, December 2020? Please and thank you, Spirit. Ooh, you know how I see and read. Please help me interpret these cards as you see fit. Thank you, Spirit. Oh, what do you have for my collective? Pisces, December 2020. December 20, well, hmm. Victory! you got to win something. And you know, that card wanted to fucking stay on the table. So I'm going to just prop this up. You're eyeing something. You're going for the prize. Okay, you're shooting for the prize. You're shooting for the prize. Where the fuck it is? Ooh. The Magician, the Strength in Reverse, the Five of Pentacles in Reverse, Three of Wands in Reverse, Three of Cups in Reverse, and the Empress. Hmm. This is the bottom of the deck energy, guys. Someone's eyeing a victory, okay? We got the Magician, the Strength in Reverse, Five of Pentacles in Reverse, Three of Wands in Reverse, and the Three of Cups in Reverse. Someone's trying to manifest. I'm going to say you. This is either your energy or their energy. Take it how it resonates, right? Someone's trying to manifest someone back. But they don't have the strength to do it because they've been blocked. They've been put out in the cold, right? They, this is like ice queen type shit. Someone's been blocked. But they're growing really impatient about getting out of a third party situation. Okay, this Three of Cups could very well be a partnership. I'm really feeling that. This is kind of like my marriage card, though. Because that just looks like a bunch of mismatched cups you have in your house, you know? But you know what? We got the Empress here, and the Empress is, is pregnant. So someone... Someone might be baby mama or baby daddy. Okay? Someone may be expecting a child in this situation. And they are in their head and guarded like a motherfucker. But their eye, and someone's got the eye on victory. Oh, so I don't know what the hell. All I know is whatever the hell you're working on, whatever the hell you're thinking about that you want to win, I think you're going to win. Six of Cups in reverse, yes. Two of Wands. Page of Wands in reverse. Okay, that's a little better. It's a little better. Five of Wands in reverse. The Star in reverse. And the World. What's this Two of Wands about? Mm. Six of Cups. Oh. Someone wants you back or you want someone back. Someone from the past that they just lost. Okay, the Six of Cups in reverse. The Six of Cups is like, you know, that's a divinely guided union. That's like, oh, that's the kind of love you want. Can't be someone from the past, but you see in that reverse, they ain't coming back. Someone done lost you. Or you lost somebody, take it how it resonates. Take it how it resonates. Someone knows they lost. They lost out on something that could have been very beautiful. A lot of love and growth. This is the type of relationship that had a lot of love and growth and a good steady foundation to it. Definitely can be someone from the past, but with the tower here in reverse, someone done lost it. Someone lost. 
Someone lost out on the chance of a beautiful fucking relationship. And now they're at a crossroads. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? They could be praying on it at night. They know they need to walk away from an emotionally draining situation. Whatever caused this loss with this six of cups, someone's like, I need to move away from this. This isn't for my higher good. But I don't know what path to go down. I don't know what to choose. I don't know where to go. And this person might be moving away from, you know, a little fuck boy, fuck girl energy. You know, at the bottom of the deck, we did see the Empress. I think someone got somebody pregnant. Someone's pregnant or someone got somebody pregnant. They're dealing with the situation. They are dealing with the situation. They're wanting to move out of that energy, though. And we got the uh, Five of Wands here. The Star. Both of those in reverse. And we got the World and the Upright. I'm getting they're coming out of this page of wands energy and you know that's just fuck boy fuck girl energy but I love how it's depicted on this card very sly person right that thinks they can get away with shit it's just someone that thinks they can get away with shit Jackie Because this person hasn't released somebody. This person hasn't healed. They're not working on it. I know it's in the reverse, but I'm not feeling like this person is healed. This person is... Um, Jackie, they have, uh, what are y'all trying to tell me with these cards? Very inter, <sighs> tell me something else. It's like they don't want the information out, guys. Ending conflict. They come out of their head. Five of swords, five of wands, double five. Expect the unexpected. That, that's it. That's it with this. You don't know how this is going to go. Or they don't know how this is going to go. They come out of their head here. Because we got the star. The star, this, this star in this deck. There's two versions. This depicts to me as someone who wants to be seen. This is someone in the spotlight. This is someone who is out there in the public. This is someone with a persona, right? In the reverse, this is this person kind of pulling back or someone not reaching their potential. But this person is in between. Release the conflict. Whew, excuse me, this is fucking draining, guys. Very... Very emotionally draining situation here. Removing this, you know, the five of swords and the rider weight is all about the narcissist. Me, 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 me. I got to win at all costs, right? And it's like they knew that that behavior, if they don't release that behavior, this star isn't going to have anything to do with it because this star doesn't want conflict. Both these women are looking in the same direction. This person wants a new start. They want a whole new world, right? They don't want no part of this, this bullshit. I don't want conflict. I don't want to deal with people that want to boss me the fuck around and think they have complete control over me. Let alone someone that I know I can't trust. I think you're the star here, Pisces. Take it how it resonates. Because at the end of the day, you know, the card that wanted to pop out at the beginning for you guys was the Six of Wands. You're going to get victory. You're going to get what you want.
But if this ain't your energy, then this is the person, this is the person that you're dealing with or so how someone is viewing you. Because you got your eye on something else. You're, you're not wanting to go back to this, this fuckery. This is you looking at a whole new world, looking at a whole new start. You're wanting to shine in your own life. This is like you coming into your own fucking power. You're not worried about, and, and you know, she's looking up at the heavens. It's like asking God for guidance, asking the universe for guidance and help. You're thinking big. You're looking up at the stars. Maybe you're reaching for the fucking stars. Whatever you got going, you want to be out there and seen. You ain't got time for some bullshit. Because we know we got a baby mama at the bottom of the deck. If y'all ain't pregnant or, or dealing with somebody, then someone else has. Because we definitely got an empress who's pregnant. We also got the magician here. Someone trying to manifest some shit back. I think you just need to focus on you. And that's where your victory is going to lie. You let whoever's coming in, whoever whoever screwed up what could have been a good thing, whoever lost you, you just need to let them just deal with their shit, okay? Just let them deal with their shit. I'm serious. You just, you, you take the L, okay? You take the L. You're good. I'm going to focus on me because I'm going to cross that finish line by myself. Thank you, please. Totally. Totally. Ooh, Pisces. That was deep. But work on you. You'll get the victory in the end. You're going to get the victory in the end. Whew. Peace, love, and light. Peace, love, and light.